We're looking at high wind warnings, Jonathan. That's right. They're going to go into effect later on this evening. Right now, it's all about the showers out there that's uh, working their way through much of the area this morning. Here is a live look in Roanoke with our Carillion Sky Cam. You see visibility is reduced a little bit with those showers coming through down to nine miles at the airport. 48 degrees the current air temperature winds right now are calm tomorrow at this time. That sky cam is likely going to be going crazy. Winds going to ramp up in a huge way late tonight. There are those showers working their way from west to east. The steadiest rain still hanging out in North Carolina. We'll get in on some moderate bursts of rain throughout the rest of the morning and into the early part of the afternoon before we take a little break and then more rain comes back in. There's one o'clock, two o'clock this afternoon. Notice we still have scattered showers around, even some embedded downpours in the darker yellows and oranges working their way through the area from west to east again. There's that short, short break from the second half of the afternoon into the early evening, but from six to eight o'clock, one last push of, of rain comes through. Maybe even a stray clap of thunder or two as this line comes in. But as that line pushes through, that is going to really start the big time winds cranking up. Looking at 11 o'clock tonight, notice we have the blue showing up. Some light snow getting going on the western slopes combined with the wind near blizzard conditions across much of the western slopes there, especially in western Pocahontas and Greenbrier counties. There could be a few light snow showers spilling over into the highlands and New River Valley, but all the accumulation is just expected on the western slopes in West Virginia. Temperatures now in the upper 40s to around 50 degrees across the area. Good morning in Huddleston getting on the school bus today. Again, rain is likely, especially in the morning, more scattered by the time the kids get off the school bus today. A little warmer than yesterday, even with the rain. Temperatures back in the lower 60s. High wind warnings again go back into effect tonight at 6 o'clock. Everyone shaded in that orange color pretty much along and west of the Blue Ridge, including parts of Southside. Wind advisory for Southside and Central Virginia. Today again, rain is continuing to be likely tonight. We are very, very windy. Temperatures again this afternoon back to around 60 degrees. Power outages down tree is going to be likely overnight tonight and into Friday. So this is the big time wind system coming in mid 50s on Saturday. Still keeping things windy, but the potentially damaging winds with this going to be winding down much calmer on Sunday and Monday. Rain chances again come back into the picture on Tuesday and Wednesday. So a big takeaway from this is if you got anything on your back porch yes. that could blow away, get that secured, bring it inside now and then prepare yourselves uh, maybe Watch what you've got in the refrigerator to maybe not yeah. do grocery shopping until later in the weekend. Charge sure. your phones, find your clothes tonight instead of maybe in the dark tomorrow. All that stuff. And yeah. then, of course, watch us in the morning because we'll be covering everything you need to know. And if you do lose power, we're live streaming on WSLS.com mm -hmm. so you can pick this thing up and tune in. There you go. All right, it is 5.